What's happening, people? It's the homie Smith, the 400, one half of straight off the Ave. Shout out to my co-host, Mr. Dubbins, and this is Smith, the Reacts. And right now, what I got for y'all is the homie Bow Wow. He not having it with the homie uh, JD's pops, man. He uh, apparently been accused of uh, delaying a lawsuit. You feel me? So shout out to Hot Entertainment. I'm finna get onto this right here, man. Off they, uh, off they John. Let's get it popping. Now, Bow Wow hits back at Jermaine Dupree's dad over accusations of lawsuit delays. Oh, gosh. Now, Bow Wow's legal spat with Michael Malden has heated up as he has taken a subliminal jab at the plaintiff on social media. A warm up to Hall Entertainment. This is your man, Gracias K. Don't forget to subscribe right now and click also on that buzzer. Now, earlier this year, Jermaine Dupree's father sued the former so so deaf assignee for alleged trademark infringement. Now, court documents obtained recently uh, show that the veteran concert promoter is now asking for more time to serve the rapper and actor of a notice of complaint in the suit. Now, uh, Bow Wow was supposed to be notified of the suit within 90 days, but Mullen says that the, the Like You hitmaker has been thus far, far unattainable since the initial filing of the complaint on September 21st, 2023. And this was due to the refusal of service by the defendant's counsel and the refusal of service at defendant's address in Atlanta, Georgia. On Friday, December 29th, the 36-year-old hopped into the, the comment section of a Hollywood unlocked Instagram post about the ordeal and wrote, check it on screen, now, a thing to keep in mind is that in late September, in late September, 2023. He said if it wasn't for JD. <laughs> Ooh, he said he, uh, he said he going to put hands on pops. In other words, sheesh. Molden filed a lawsuit against Bow Wow for his use of the Scream Tour name. The 70 year old producer who was instrumental in fostering Dupree's career is laying claim that what's known as common law trademark, which is why he's pretty much suing the Ohio native as well, and as others, has been pretty much violated. A common law trademark is one that is established solely through use in com commerce in a spe specific geographical area. Now, according, this is pretty much according to German law. Now, that includes business names, logos, and phrases that are regularly used, even though they have never been federally registered, can all be considered common law trademarks. Now, Molden's claim is that he's been using the name Scream Tour for his own tours for decades, even though he only formally trademarked the name two months after the Black Promoters Collective, who are also named in the lawsuit, filed the trademark for themselves. Now, in fact, Molden is claiming that Bow Wow was well aware of who truly owned the Scream Tour trademark because he was on the tour himself. Yeah? I mean, share your thoughts on that. Because the thing, he said this, the first and subsequent Scream Tour uh, live musical performance events and tours were in 2001 to 2002, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 10, 12, 15, 16, and 2017, and have been highly successful in attracting, cultivating, and promoting teenage and young adult music performers in the music industry. Yo, that tour been going on for mad long. Crazy. Now, it also he also included that based on whether new teenage and young adult music performers were ready to perform, Mr. Molden made decisions each year whether to conduct the Scream Tour at a trademark, live music performance, events, and tour. Music performers included uh, Neo, T.I., Chris Brown, Trey Songs, uh, Sierra, T-Pain, and, and more. So, obviously, <laughs> obviously, there's a lot going on here. But here's the thing, team. We'll keep you up to date with the latest. But you do not want to miss out. So subscribe right now and stay up to date with the latest. That's crazy. The homie Bow Wow, man. So it's all over the Scream Tour. I could see how Bow could feel some type of way about the Scream Tour when, like, you know, he been on the Scream Tour since 
the first screen tour. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It is kind of centered around him for real at this point. And I guess what was it? B2K and him, but yeah. Shout out to Bow Wow, man. He said pop. <laughs> he said <laughs> If it wasn't for JD Pop, so yeah, you feel me with the little with the little uh, little devil emoji. But um, yeah, man, how y'all feel about this, man? Like, share, comment, subscribe. Who y'all think should you know have the rights to the screen tour? I think maybe Bow Wow, bro. I think I think Bow Wow got that, but that's my opinion. Anyway, yeah, this has been Smith to Reacts. We out, man. Owie.